but he managed to get he through. He got it stopped. He got it stopped perfectly. Oh, it's hey, a big crash in the big background. Crash three riders. Vickers. That's Bucken. Yeah, that's Bucken. Danny Bucken. That is Bucken. Oh, this is so costly for Danny. He would have work to do from 15th. Ryan Vickers looks like he's in some pain there as well, who'd also qualify poorly. I hope Ryan's OK. This one looks Is nasty. that Josh Owens as well? It looks like Josh Owens involved yep. as well. So, as it stands at the moment, after that crash, we've got the two Rich Energy OMG Yamahas, one and two, with Brad Ray looking to already now pull out of the slipstream of his teammate Kyle Ride. In third is Christian Hidden, and fourth is Tommy Bridewell, and Ray leads on under the bridge on the approach to Brundle and Nelson. Yeah, got a really nice run out the corner onto the straight and then a good slipstream and that was a classic overtaking move here at Snet. We've got a safety car out after that incident as Christian Niven just goes up into third. Nice move into the bomb hole there. Nasty accident that. We hope that Ryan Vickers is OK. Uh, he's he's up. up on his feet. That's good to see. But the safety car is out as they look to try and clear this up. Yeah, they've got to get on there, got onto the grass and get the bike shifted. Obviously, uh, there's a danger if anybody else slid off there. You don't want to be in oh. a bike at any speed that's lying on the floor. Uh, so quite obviously, a safety car is needed. Yeah, arms up here just from a few of the riders as, yeah, they've, as they've seen the safety car. Yeah, there's, there's lighting boards now, yeah. so they will know. There's no way you can miss a signal from race direction here now. Yeah, so let's have a look at the replay then and see uh, how this one unfolded, James. Let's have a look. It'll be in the back of the shot. Yeah, you can't really see how it started. Obviously, uh, three bikes into one don't necessarily go. Let's have a look. I mean, yeah, again, you couldn't really see. I don't want to judge early, but the body language of Danny Buchan suggests he doesn't believe it was his fault. I would agree with you there. And again, we're not going to see much on this either. Yeah. Okay. Well, you know it's what? A it's, a different, it's a difficult one to call that. It is. Um, so, yeah. Well, there you go. I mean, Danny Buchan, who got himself into showdown contention with two brilliant wins at Cadwell. Is this the moment his showdown chances are blown? Race one. Of course, we have two races still here at Snetterton tomorrow. But now it's...